and thank you for watching Brooklyn's Barbie Bay. And today we are back. We have cleared the entire board in the back. As you can see, there's no doll shoes. There's no doll anything because I was able to pick up the mini brands, mini fashion dream wardrobe. So not only are we going to put this together today, but we absolutely have to make sure that we look everything over we put our doll stuff in and see if we have enough room for some of our doll shoes doll purses and all of that so i wanted to go through this with you guys today it says we can store and display your mini fashion collection and i'm thinking i'm hoping that means all of our mini fashion collections so it looks like on here we got some stylist stuff we can use we've got some purses we can put in here it looks like we can put in a travel case um, so let's get into it. Let's go ahead and open up the dream wardrobe and decide if this is something we want to use as our new backdrop or should we bring back the shoes and everything else? Let's get into it. Okay, so here we have on the back of our box, it shows exactly what we're going to, what's going to come in our packaging. As you can see, there is the wardrobe case. It looks like there's a little mini dresser, a stool. There is a, um, mirror. A collectible purse some flowers some hangers um, it looks good from here it says collect more capsules to add more bags and accessories and eh, not doing that because it costs too much and from phase one to phase two I just wasn't impressed so I'm gonna use some of my other doll um, items like you know our illustrious rainbow high stuff that's always great some of our Barbie stuff we're gonna use a couple of things in here and see what we can put together but let me go ahead and get everything out of the box so I can show you how we put it together okay so now that I've gotten everything out of the box as you can see the um, pieces have come together you also have some mini fashion packs that come with this um, you also have the backdrop for each piece so I'm going to go ahead and assemble the backdrop get it kind of mini put together and then it doesn't like it, it doesn't look like it's too hard you also have a huge book um, that kind of tells you how to put everything together so give me one second let's try to put at least the furniture together and we'll do the rest together okay so now that we have constructed and put everything together I've left the um, blue on the um glass because i'm not ready to take that off yet now it lets you know that it's time for you to construct everything and, and put it all together it was pretty simple to put together honestly you guys maybe about five to ten minutes to get everything you know on there and ready to go so let's open up our fashion packs and, and these i've had to open some of them because you will have to take out some of your um like look through to get some of the accessories to pop on like the little plastic um, backs here um, you're gonna have to open up some of them to get these like to get the hanger rack on and also to put your fasteners on the back to hold the background so that's what that was so our first thing that I had already opened was the magical chest I call it you know the mini fashion chest on the actual box it says it goes up here so I'm gonna put it there that's cute okay um, that's all that's in that one. Then we're going to go to our next piece, which this looks like it's going to be the, you've got some hangers. We can go and hang these up. And I'm looking at, these look like the ends. They may be the ends of the table. So we'll play with that in a moment. But let's go ahead and put our cute little hangers up here. Okay, got them all going in the right direction. No wire hangers. All right. Next piece we have is, it looks like the long tray. So this is probably what this is. That goes to our little tray piece that you can see. It does open out let's see how this snaps on mm -hmm. wait I think I'm doing it wrong 
Hold on a second. Okay, I had to get the legs on sturdy. Looks like I did that right. Okay, so you got the long table here. In our next bag, we have, okay, we got some accessories we gotta put together. Okay. You've got a lamp. Looks like this will go inside of this. Mm -mm, one just fell out. And we have, uh oh, what looks like to be a lamp stand. So, I mean, the mirror stand. So give me one second. One of our flowers just said goodbye. So, I want to make sure we don't miss that. Okay, so, so far, I think everything is looking pretty good. Um, I gotta find a way to fasten back this little flower onto our petal here, because it looked like it came off, but it looks like it can snap right back in. So, I'll play with that in a minute. Okay, and then in our last bag, we have what looks to be our small seat. Oh, and a mannequin head. Isn't that cute? Okay. All right. So we're going to snap open, snap on our seat to our chair here. I have to forget that this is not tall. Okay, now we have our little small seat. Okay, so it looks pretty okay. Let me grab a couple things and we'll see. Okay, so here we are completely set up the way that um, I kind of just fashioned it how it is on the box cover. And here is the platinum bag, I believe, or the, you know, it's really a cute purse. Um, and it's a gold purse, you guys. It has like some um, initials on it and it looked like, you know, like the hanging purse initials, which are super cute. Um, and then, you know, it opens it's a really cute gold little clutch so i do like this definitely want to set it up on one of the shelves by itself because it's that girl and i'm thinking um, as i'm sitting here looking at this i'm like okay is it scaled to our dolls and some of their things not sure but i do have one that i want to uh -oh, open with you all so we can absolutely see so I forgot that I got this um, this Barbie doll here. And because she has that carry-all case, I absolutely want to see if she can fit and if, she, if she's to scale with this particular doll. But she's not articulated, and that's okay because I do have an articulated doll that we can absolutely look at um, really quick before we open her and see what she has going on. So aside from her... Remember, you guys, I did make this um, doll articulated. I don't think I showed you all in the video that she comes unarticulated. She was $14.99, and it's, she's, um, like, I want to say maybe the marine biology. I don't know what she actually is. She's a beach doll. She's one of the beach parties, the new ones that I was talking to you all about. So I did, I was able to find her a made-to-move body. So she'd be great, I think, to see if she can sit in this doll chair. So let's see how this works. okay all right it's it's cute she's doing it she's got a little extra room here and absolutely she can go over to her closet you know and find her clothing and reach up and get stuff okay she's working it okay what about oh I, I'm, I'm feeling her um doing this so let's see um what kind how would i style this i'm trying to think like right off the rip what would i want to absolutely do as far as my clothing and, and stuff so give me a sec let me throw a couple things up there you let me know what you think once you see it okay so here we are completed what do you think I absolutely love it I think it's gorgeous and I think it's definitely going to be a part of our new backdrop I mean I think it's super cute um, you've got the mirrors, you've got a small chair for your doll, 
I just went ahead and threw up some of my Rainbow High and my mini fashion um, accessories up there. I just went ahead on this side and threw some glasses, some necklaces on the second shelf, and the book bags from our Rainbow High dolls on the bottom shelves. But you know you can arrange this any way you want to. I just threw a hat from our Tiana collection, the ILY, on here, and one of the necklaces. This opens, but I didn't put anything in it right now. But I absolutely love this set. I, I would definitely say go out and grab this for your dolls. And speaking of dolls and sets of opening, I have a new doll set. Well, she's not new. She's a little older. But absolutely think that it's a great time for us to unbox a doll while we just unbox in a completely doll room. So this is our Barbie and she looks like she's a traveling Barbie, as you can see. Doesn't necessarily have a name. I got her because I wanted her outfit for one of my other dolls. But I also saw some really cute traveling accessories that I thought would be cool as well. As you can see, she comes with the clog heels, which I love. She's got a opening um, with has travel stickers for you to decorate on her um, suitcase. And that trusty neck pillow to fall asleep with. So let's go ahead and get her out of the box and see what we got. Okay, so we are back now and I have unboxed our traveling Barbie, which is what I'm going to just call her because that seems to be what she's doing. Let's start with what she comes with. So this doll comes with a very cute purple um, and it doesn't roll, which I hate when Barbie does that. Like they create this great, you know, um, piece and then it doesn't do anything, but it does open and close so you can put some of her various items inside them. But she comes with her rolling suitcase. She also comes with a backpack, which already has like a couple of appliques on them. Okay, so it's a purple backpack. It does open a little bit, so you can also put a couple things in there as well. She does come with a face mask to put around her face. She comes with a teal colored camera to take pictures. I don't know why I actually thought that was a purse at first. She, uh -oh. she comes with a little handheld phone. She comes with a cute yellow fanny pack. She does come with a headrest pillow with the little cat ears or dog ears on them, whichever you'd like it to be. She comes with a puppy. Now what would have been cute is if they gave her like a little carry-all for the puppy because it's like, where's the puppy gonna go? He can't go inside the suitcase and definitely can't go inside the book bag. He'll, something might happen to him. And then she comes with um, a water bottle she comes with a bottle of like lotion or some sort. And she also comes with a small mini toothbrush. Really super cute, I like that. So these are the things that she comes with. And then they also gave you a pair, a set of stickers to put on your travel bag to make it look like she went a couple of places. You know, we can always do this really quickly, right? Like just throwing a couple stickers on there. Make it look like she's a traveler. Um, let's see, I'll put this one on the back, but I think it's a cute idea. She has like a sticker passport. Um, I always put this one on top cause you know, this is your luggage information. So we'll put that one right there for her, but I think it's, you know, it's, it's really cute once you start kind of decorating your your stuff that and I never really like do decorations and stuff on my doll stuff so this is neat for me I never really play with it like that like I just show it but pretty cool to put you know some Barbie stuff on here and I'm just at this point sticking stuff because I feel like that's what people do they just stick stuff anywhere you know on there um Just giving, just judging it up a little bit, guys. Putting a couple XOs and hearts and stuff like that on there. So yeah, this is this particular part. Oh, this is cute. I got ice creams. I got a burger. Yeah, I absolutely love it. So I didn't put all of them when I left a couple, but this is pretty much what you can do with your fashion accessories that come with this doll. <laughs> Then, excuse me, let's go to the doll herself. So, you know, she doesn't come with the doll stand at all. She does come with this really cute 
um, dress. And I like this dress because it kind of has like a shimmer kind of like to it. I don't know if you can really see it. Oh, something came off of my hand. Um, and then she comes with a pair of green glasses that are hooked to her hand. She's got this purple hat, like I call them like a dumpster hat, you know, like I'm trying to not let anybody know who I am. So maybe she's some high end celebrity. Um, she has on those pink clogs that I want so bad. So, so glad. Um, and then her hair, let me take this so we can, I can show you fully. Um, it is, you know, kind of all meshed down in the packaging. Okay, so this is what she look. Uh oh, this is what she looks like. Ooh, thank you, Jesus. This is what she looks like outside of her. She's a pretty doll. I might have to keep her and find her a made to move body. I absolutely love her hair too. Um, and then you have a little hat for her to put on as well. But I bought her because I wanted the dress, but I'm absolutely liking the doll. But definitely the dress is coming and going. So this is our set today. We have this beautiful um, mini fashion set that I absolutely love that will now become a part of our background as we bring our shoes back in and a couple things we can make our doll room kind of now zhuzh a little bit and we had a new doll that we unboxed this is the fashion um, Barbie travel doll I think her accessories are cute I think her face scope is cute she does have just the regular five points of articulation you guys so you know she's got the head back and forth movement movement out and in of the arms same thing of the legs um, but they're tied down. That's smart. That wasn't smart. Um, they're, they're tied. Okay, I just undid them. But <laughs> now you can see that the feet, I mean, the legs do move out and in a little bit back and forth. So, um, she's a really cute doll. Um, love her sculpt as well. So I'm going to see what I got as far as made to move bodies. We might keep her, but the dress is going because that's why I bought her. Well, thank you guys for sitting in today and sitting with us and viewing this amazing set. What have Has anyone received one yet? Have you gotten one of your own and let me know how you decorated it um, or anything that you would do differently? Please feel free to let me know. I love this set. I, I love the fact that my dolls can all use it and their accessories and stuff can use it. So I'm definitely looking at how I arrange things moving forward. And if you want to get sassy with it, buy yourself two and make it one huge big closet. Hmm. That might be an idea. Well, thank you guys so much again for watching my channel. If you haven't had an opportunity, please hit the like button. And also, if you're not subscribed to my channel and you like my content, please hit the um, subscribe button and become a part of our dolly verse and our dolly world i'll have a couple of more videos coming out this week i'm looking forward to um seeing you guys again and thanks for having an amazing day and thanks again for watching brooklyn's barbie bay have a great day you guys